The polls are going to be open in less than 24 hours all across our state. Monday is the first day of early voting here in Georgia for the presidential primary. Our very own Liza Lucas spoke with political experts about what we could expect, what could play out in the Peach State. It's time to hit the polls. Early voting starts Monday and runs for the next three weeks. Yet as Georgians make their pick for the presidential primary, Emory University political science professor Dr. Andre Gillespie points to major questions lingering over the race. So I think the big question that a lot of people are going to be asking is, will Nikki Haley stay in the race beyond South Carolina and definitely beyond Super Tuesday? If she does end up dropping out of the race, that essentially leaves uh, former President Trump with no uh, real uh, competition. Meanwhile, on the Democratic side, President Biden has actually performed well in primaries, even in places where he wasn't officially on the ballot. I think it's a question of whether or not Dean Phillips stays in the race. And so I expect that on the Democratic side, it's going to be a coronation as well. The narrow field of candidates for both parties, Gillespie believes, could result in lower voter turnout for the primaries. But there are a few things to keep in mind as you do head to the polls. Chandra Little with Fulton County Elections says one notable difference this election season is a result of SB 129, which went into effect in July. Now with this law, voters are able to take up to two hours off from work to be able to go participate in early voting, similar to our election day law. Of course, you have to work it out, you know, with your employer, but you do by law now, you get a, you're able to take up to two hours off. And another key point to keep in mind. Presidential primaries don't run on the same cycle um, as primaries for other office, particularly uh, Congress. So Georgians will return to the polls to cast their vote on separate ballots in May for congressional primaries and other races. In Atlanta, Liza Lucas, 11 Alive News. And don't forget, this is early voting for the presidential primary election. It's going to run from tomorrow tomorrow through March 8th. Precinct's going to be open up on the weekends and you can check your voting location on the My Voter page on the Secretary of State's website. The primary election is March 12th.